Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Laughing Boy here, and this is going to be a Grand Theft Auto online video on how to cheat death on the Criminal Mastermind Challenge. Now, this works on the PlayStation 4, and I don't know how to tell you how to get it to how to do this on the Xbox One or the PC. So, uh, bear that in mind. Um, now, this thing was completely stumbled upon by accident by my good friend Ewitz, and uh, you've probably heard him on my uh, on my channel on occasion. And uh, I'm going to leave a link in the description below to Ewitz Games. He's uh, he's just starting his channel out, but I definitely want to give him full credit on this. Uh, this is his glitch. Now, it's still early in the video, but if you do go on to enjoy the video, or if you find the video informative or helpful, please remember to leave a like. Now, I know that there are several people out there that have put off doing the Criminal Mastermind Challenge, or not even ever really considered doing it, because of the fact that it is quite a daunting task. In order to complete Criminal Mastermind, you have to be you have to do all of the heist and all of the setups in order with the same people on the hard difficulty and nobody can die ever. <laughs> At least that's the way it's supposed to be. Here I'm going to show you how to work around the hardest one of those and that is the the death now, in order to do this, you're going to need to be able to communicate, so you're going to need these things. You're also going to need to be in a party outside of the game. So, um, because you're going to be able, uh, again, you're going to need to be able to communicate, but you're going to be able to, you're going to need to be able to communicate independently from the game. Now before you get started, there are a few things you're going to need to do, but I'm going to go ahead and tell you what it is you're going to be doing so you understand why you need to do these things in preparation. Um, what you're going to be doing is closing the application. So before you get started, you need to make absolutely sure that there's nothing running in the background. There's nothing running on your system but Grand Theft Auto 5. You're also going to need to establish some sort of a safe word or a password something that you will remember when you're panicking and something that they'll remember that they'll um, immediately understand as close the application and the third thing you're going to want to do is to start the game up press and hold the playstation button and go the menu will pop up on the left hand side and you're going to need to go to the top of that menu where it says close application and just uh, hover there. You're also Then you're going to need to back out, go back into the game. Now, um, of course, like I said, what you're going to be doing is closing the application. When the time comes, if, you know, if it's necessary, if you're going to die, or in fact, if you have died, just yell out your you know your 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 safe word your password tell everybody it's time to close the application and then go press and hold the playstation button and spam the x button you need to close that application as soon as possible you can save the criminal mastermind after someone dies but only you only have a very small window if it says so and so died down in the lower left hand corner just above the mini map then you should be okay however if it gets to the failed screen you have indeed failed so make sure that everybody closes the application before that happens now um i hope that this has helped you i hope this has been informative thank you guys so much for watching Please remember, not only for myself, but for any YouTube video that you happen to see out there, please remember to leave a like if you liked it. Thank you so much for watching. Have a wonderful day. Laughing Boy out.